Oh, hey. Hi. Hmm. I got this for Nana to help her with, uh, you know. Memory stuff? Yeah. Which is being made too much of. Or not enough. Oh, yeah. Let me show you. Tilly. <clears throat> so, <clears throat> if I uh, ever get lost in the backwoods, uh, you know, snowboarding or something like that, I just tap this twice. He's never been on a snowboard. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> Everyone? Now, I came all the way from Calgary just to be here today. But the truth is, I would fly to the moon to be with my sister. <laughs> oh, sweetie. <laughs> and that reminds me of that time when we were both hit on by a rock star at a uh, festival in Toronto in 72. We were, we were, She's showing her age. <laughs> it wasn't a festival. It was a feminist march. And it wasn't a rock star. It was... Sorry. And thank God I was there, too. I stole you away. <laughs> you were so romantic. Uh, he was so straight. That, too. Here's to my darling wife, Dottie, on her birthday, and my darling sister-in-law, Lynn, who has always gone the extra mile. Bless you both. Happy Cheers. Birthday, Cheers. 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 Love you. Happy birthday. Hey. Oh. It's a family secret, but I can tell you, it's just so hard watching one's mother gradually disintegrating, her mind disappearing. Oh, you are the best. Thank you. And this is one of our good days. You want to cut the cake? Yeah. I think your mom is amazing, but if you guys ever need any help, we're just around the corner. I'm close by. Oh, great. Thanks. Yeah, thank yeah, you. Thanks for that. Thanks. It was so great to meet you. Of course. It was so great to meet you, too. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. Oh, my little buddy. Oh, so nice. there for me today. Okay. Really Text me. Anytime. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Bye. All right. Thank you. It was so nice meeting you. Yeah. Of Have fun in Sonoma. Of course. Hello, <laughs> huh. family secret telling? That's got to be my favorite right there. That, that really is, is great. Oh, Sometimes we're been, different. This has been so special. Lynn? Thanks for coming, Lynn. It's late. Why is this place so noisy? I should have booked my usual hotel. It's okay, sweetie. He's six foot five. I know. Like With law. Arms this big, they go like elastics. Yeah, well, bigger than yours, obviously. You're like five nine. But I think Auntie Lynn needs to sleep upstairs with me tonight. Why? I think the party was just a little bit too much for her. Oh, what? I thought she was having a great time. Uh, I don't know. She seems a little out of it. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. I still can't believe they sent her here by herself. Mm. Jake! A little text from you guys. I thought I might want to show my face right here. Ah. You call this a hotel? Uh, Lynn, you're at your sister's. Well, I'm not paying good money to stay here. Noisy kids running up and down the hallways. Uh, look, you're, that's Dottie's guest room. You're visiting. 
I want to see the manager. Uh, I want to be moved to a different bedroom. They have the hotel manager's right here. He can speak with you. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, uh, I, there are children running up and down the halls. It's unacceptable. I'm so sorry, ma'am. We'll make sure that there's uh, no noise. Move you to another room. Mm -hmm. uh, would you like some room service? C can we f fold back the bed for you? Anything you need. Jake? Everything's gonna be okay, Mom. Can I show you to your room? <laughs>